Hey everyone, this is Mike. Hi, and I'm Michelle. And this is Lovey's Fat Life. And today we're going to check out something that we have kind of foo fooed in the past, and that's the Carnival Cheers package. We recently went on the Carnival Sunshine on a four day cruise. It was our first four day cruise we've ever done, right, yes. Michelle? Mm -hmm. And um, and we went just to Bimini. So we had uh, started out with a sea day or two sea days, then Bimini, and then a sea day. And uh, so it was. You know, it was it was pretty cool. I think that was right. Is that right? So, yeah. I think it, maybe. I don't know. We had our first Either, day, C day, and then Bimini, Bimini and then our right, home C day. Way back. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So the first day really was embarkation day. So yeah. it was the day we got on the ship. So we want to talk about that and let you know we've always in the past that it wasn't worth it for us because we're not big drinkers. And even on this cruise, we never hit ten alcohol drinks in one day because I heard once you right. I heard once you hit ten. It puts it on the bottom of your receipt. So you can call us lightweights, not heavy drinkers. I don't know. Whatever you want to call us. Maybe we're just wimps. I don't know. But we did uh, purchase other things like milkshakes, mm -hmm. Gatorade, right. specialty coffee, mm -hmm. uh, water. Um, so we did purchase other things to equal out. So, Michelle, on day one, which was embarkation day, and on one, you know, the normal price is $59.95 plus tax and gratuity and i'm going to put the total up right here what we paid for the entire four day cheers package but day one just a heads up they do charge you tax while you're in port right. so when you purchase drinks you'll see something on there you're like wait a minute i got the drinks package they are charging you tax while you're in port once you're away they don't charge you anymore so just a heads up on that ahead of time if you do decide to get this so michelle how many drinks do we hit on day one 17. That's cumulative. 17 accumulative between the both of us. Mm -hmm. uh, so you both, if you're both in the cabin, you both have to purchase it or all the adults in that cabin have to purchase it. Mm -hmm. um, we got a son that's 12. Uh, of course, he didn't have to buy it. <laughs> we don't let him drink, but <laughs> we we got 17 drinks total. That is, not, that is just drinks total. That's not, you get 15 drink limit per adult on alcohol-based drinks. And then you can get all the other ones like milkshakes, coffee, Gatorade, soda, soda is, is doesn't count towards that 15 right. piece total. And that's unlimited. And it is unlimited. Yeah, that, that part of it is unlimited. So we hit 17 total for the day. That's a combination of drinks, Gatorade, coffee, milkshakes, water, whatever. Uh, day two, Michelle, was our sea day. It was our biggest day. What did we hit? The, what would we have that day, Michelle? 29. So again, we never hit the 10 drinks. So that just tells you, even if we hit nine and nine, it's 18. I tell you, there's 11 other drinks that we got that were either milkshakes, Gatorade, yeah. water, soda, soda, um, things of that nature. So mm -hmm. pretty big day two, definitely paid off that day. Um, day three, Michelle, this was a day we went to Bimini and we spent a lot of money in Bimini. But that's not counted. That's not counted in this. That's right. <laughs> so day three, Michelle. 21. So 21. Okay. That was the day we were in Bimini. 21 drinks uh, between sodas, water, alcohol. Still didn't ever, never hit 10. And Michelle, day four, what did we hit? This was our last C day. 21 also. 21 also. So mm -hmm. it's a pretty good amount if you add them up. Um, you know, if you just said they were $5 a drink on average, I mean, uh, the sodas are $4, I believe, on the ship. So if you just add that up alone, um, let's say they were $5 a round up. I mean, that's uh, that's 85 you know, 145 105 and 105 And it was fifty nine ninety nine each, so that's $120 you're spending a day plus tax and gratuity. But we got, Michelle was drinking some woo-hoos, woo-hoos, woo-hoos. And I was drinking a lot of, um, uh, if they had Crown, I was drinking Crown. If not, I was doing a lot of Crown and Coke, Crown and Pepsi, actually, because they carry Pepsi products. Um, so what is your thought, Michelle? On a four-day cruise, do you think this was worth it? Absolutely. Absolutely. Um, what do they say? Is it six a piece that they say that on average that it pays for itself? Yes. Um, so, I mean... Again, we're not going to hit that 15, not that I think we will, uh, but just the other drinks along the soda, the, I mean, the coffees, I mean, the um, 
the milkshakes, I think, is four or five, six bucks a piece for those. Yeah, pricey. Um, one thing we did notice, and one thing you should pay attention to, and we didn't notice it until today when I was adding them up, is we got charged one time for a milkshake, and we should have got it free. I don't know if our son went and got him one he and didn't have, tell us about it. He may have put it on his card, and that is where the cost is. All right. So overall, we think it's well worth it on a four day cruise, especially only got one port. Um, yeah. We're going to maybe possibly try on a fifth one. I will say this. I did find myself drinking things that maybe I would not normally drink. Mm -hmm. Normally we don't buy it. Uh, it's the first time we've ever bought it. And we'll, we'll just get water in a room. We bring sodas on the ship, but I was like, treat myself to a milkshake or Gatorade. Um, and I was a little more adventurous trying new things as well. Yeah. And also remember, cause a couple of charges we had on here, if you go to the dining room, mm -hmm. They do charge you in the dining room um, for like the specialty drinks they have walking around with. If there's anything souvenir in a souvenir cups, cup, they yeah, will not gonna, pay for it. They're going to charge you for that. So souvenir mm -hmm. items are not included in that. Um, but I mean, you know, sometimes you buy some things. Like I, I bought a in Havana Bar area, just a souvenir carnival cup to bring home. And I've uh, got all the colored shot glasses. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you guys for checking out this quick video. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, please like, comment, and subscribe. And hey, have, do you buy the Cheers package? Do you think it's worth it or not? We've always said no in the past, but this time it was. We're questioning it. All right, have a good one. Thank you. Bye.